I'm Mr. Grinler, and here are my creatures. Welcome back to another episode of Mr. Grinless Creatures, but on today's episode, we have a package that has come from Troy. So, Craig was selling his centipede, and I think Craig has swapped his centipede for some spiders, um, which I've received today, and I'm going to be rehousing. So, Craig works long hours during a week, he works 12 hour days. He, you know, when he gets back, he has very limited time of actually like, stuff to do. So, uh, yeah, you, you know, I don't mind helping out rehousing tragedies for him. Because, um, you know, it's uh, content at the end of the day. <laughs> but without saying much, let's go down to this table and let's have a look at this package. Because, uh, yeah, I'm excited to open it up. It's exciting. So our guest today is a very special day within Mr. Grinder's Creatures. And that is mainly because I can't remember the last time I actually unboxed any tarantulas in this room, on this table... It's just, yeah, it's been forever. So, I hope you enjoy it all. Okay, so enough messing around. Let's just have a look inside this box. Please don't use scissors like this. But let's have a look what's inside. Hopefully there's no red runners this time. I don't know if any of you ever saw on an old channel when uh, Troy sent me some uh, red runners in a little pot. I unboxed it live on stream. Must say though, poly box. So that's good. Troy cares about the warmth of the teas, which is good to see. Uh, let me just cut the other side quick. So I'm just cutting where the cellar tape is to where the. There we are. So where the cellar tape was, just there. Just so it was a perfect little cut. Heat pack inside. Nice and toasty, I must admit. Okay, so. Uh, <laughs> it says LP on. Uh, so, for Mictopus Green Coal Carapace, we have got. I'm not sure which is in this. Um, this one ain't labelled. So, that is the female Harpacteria Pulcropes. Uh, this is. The I don't know. I'm gonna have to open them up and have a look. Um, I'm not entirely sure 100% what you know they agreed. So I'm gonna have to open them up, have a look, uh, see what we got. But I've got a bit of an understanding what we have here. So yeah, give me two minutes and I'll set everything up. But uh, yeah, I'm very impressed with this package and very impressed. Right. So I'm assuming this is the H uh, Pulcropes female, so the Harpacteria Pulcropes female. Should we go in just inside here? There we are. Do you see her? She is just down here. If you give me two seconds, I'll get this pot out. So this is a young female. Absolutely beautiful. I do like the Harpacteria pulcropes. So for now, I thought I'll stick her in an enclosure like this. It's really basic. The uh, it's just topsoil. It's it's you know quite dry. 
Uh, there's a water dish, there's bits of bark in there, so obviously we keep her in air and then as she grows older, we stick her into a nice glass enclosure uh, for breeding in the future. But let's get this gal out quick. So she is currently on this end, so I'm going to try and just ease her out. I don't know, she's going to be. I don't know if there's a way on the end of the other tissue, maybe. Yeah, so there's only one exit. Only one exit, girl. So if you could move your ass back. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna unravel you then. Oh, you're coming now. Here we are. So, you can see her just coming out the back there. Oh, you're nearly out now. There we are. Wasn't hard. Okay, so up next, we're going to do the Formictopus green gold carapace, which is going inside this just normal Braplast tub. So, it's, again, it's got some topsoil, some master leaf litter, water dish, and a bit of bark for a hide. I'll spin this around this way. Where is she? I think she's upside down, so give me two seconds. She is actually pretty big. Or he. that brightness up a bit. Sorry, you can't really see much, but there you go. Absolutely stunning. Doesn't really want to let go of the tissue, though. Hello? Hello? May I have the tissue, please? Hey, there you go. Right, <laughs> I've got the tissue. Um, so again, I'm going to get some macro shots of this in a second. Nice, easy re -ass. That's how we like them. Let's just keep dishing these out now. Let's get on the ball. Get on the ball. Get on that ball. It's really hard to do. So it's on its back currently, and it should now be on its side, and it's now coming out. There we are. Okay. Uh, absolutely beautiful. That is stunning. Really, absolutely just stunning at that, that size. All right, let's do the next one quick. So, let's delve into this one. This is the last one out of all of them. There's no red runners yet either. <laughs> Oh, thank God for that. Oh, this one looks like a bit of a Larry guy. There we have it, one more. What I normally do is probably just show the shots after the rear, so I'm just going to show a bunch of combined shots because, yeah, these are absolutely stunning. And I can't wait to have a closer look at these. These are absolutely fascinating. I do like the H. Polkrapees. We've already got uh, an adult female in the collection and we've also got a juvenile as well, so. Stunners. So from the looks of all of this, like I said, I, I still don't know 100%. I'm gonna have to ask Craig and get him to uh, confirm it or try. Uh, but yeah, it looks like there's a H. Uh, Polkrapees female. Uh, there is a, obviously for Mixpus Green Gold Carapace and then I'm going to assume that these are two males because I remember him going on about a female and two males. So, yeah, 
I'm assuming these are two males, the other one's a female. And then we've got the green gold carapace. So yeah, absolutely brilliant. Reasses were absolutely fine. But now, let's have a look at some footage of it. Because, uh, yeah, I can't wait. Look at that.
Right, so that is all the footage for today's episode. I really do hope you enjoyed the unboxing, the rehouses, the feeds. You know, I just love doing this and displaying it all for you in a, a way that I can edit it up. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, as always. And a massive thank you to Troy once again for sending Craig these spiders. But that is it for today. So if you could like, comment and share, that would be absolutely great. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon so you're notified of when I upload next. And don't forget guys, I've got Patreon now, five different tiers. So if you want to help and support the channel, there's a link down in the description. But thank you very much for watching guys. So Mr. Grin has done it. So are my creatures. So are my Balfouris, which are everywhere. I'll see you next time, guys. Have a great week. You all deserve it. Peace.